They are complaining about your body. They are talking about your body. They think you walk with a limb. In other words, they think you are not as perfect as you look from a distance. This word is for you. Shalom, the Lord bless you. Welcome to Purpose and Marita Bliss with Pastor Honoring. Excuse, I have a prophetic word for someone. They are talking about your body. They think you walk with a limb. They think you are not as perfect as you look from a distance. And this word is coming to someone. Just to encourage you and say they really don't have a clue. It's coming to us to look at the story of Jacob. It's easy for people to see Jacob limping after the penial encounter. And they say something is wrong with his leg. And they judge him because he's limping and they judge him because of that. But no one has a clue why he is limping. No one understands why he's limping. No one understands that it was God that dislocated his hip bone. No one. And it's easy for people to just say, see that and, and say you are, you, are, you are in error and say funny things. They don't understand that you have been wrestling, Jacob, that you've wrestled with God and with man. You've wrestled, you've had to fight all through your life. You had to fight for what belongs to you. You have to fight for the promises of God over your life. You had to fight to marry the woman you love. You had to fight to, 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 to have your inheritance, to have your... your your reward, your payment, what you deserve, working from your uncle, working with your uncle. You had to fight. And you fought with men and you fought with God. And that's the result. That's why you are limping. So people will judge you without knowing you. They will judge you without concluding. They will look at you and they conclude on you without even understanding. Today, God just says, I should tell someone, let them keep talking. They have no clue. They just see what they are looking at. They don't know the story. Don't let it bother you. Let them talk what they are saying. Let them continue talking while God is working with you, while God is doing what he's doing with you. Hallelujah. God bless you. Shalom.